Is it, uh, is it well known enough? Did people see this in arcades? I never saw this. I've seen like maybe one other cabinet that wasn't at uh, at Galloping Ghost. And I think it was at like uh, it wasn't Northwest Pinball Show. It was like another convention. Maybe it was Magfest. I don't know. I can't. I don't know. Anyway, Capcom's Section Z. I don't know. I didn't. Uh, I didn't think this game was that was that popular. Did get an NES port that was way the fuck different. The sections aren't even lettered in the uh, in the the NES version. They're numbered. <laughs> There's no section Z. It's like section twenty. Like what? It's not the same game. Arcade version's way different. Uh, did I have another? Yeah, I did. Uh, okay, let's see here. There's some more. In the year 2XXX, we're gonna fucking make it a, as uh, obscure as possible. The Balangul Empire rampages through space at will and invades one planet after another. The evil hands are finally reaching towards the planet Earth with a lowercase e. You're a lonely astronaut in space. You must penetrate the enemy base, which is divided into sections from A to Z. And must destroy the L brain in final target section Z. Can you carry out this vital mission? So this game's deal is... Uh, uh, you have a turnaround button. I thought it was like sidearms, where like one button fires left and one button fires right, but no, it's, a, it's an actual turnaround button, so... You can't get sandwiched by enemies. You can actually uh, sh turn around and shoot the ones on the left side. And there's a... Uh, you automatically drop bombs, too. Uh, and there's like a... Uh, you have to pick up three Ps to... Uh, or is it just one P? Every time you pick up a power-up, you get like a, a small, a small power-up. And you can advance speed, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Um, I've never actually done a loop of this on one credit. I've I've played it a bit, but I always get like stuck on one of the stages. So uh, we'll see how this goes. I mean, I can credit feed, but it is checkpoint based. So we'll see how it goes. It's on Legendary Wings hardware, which... Is Legendary Wings 85 or 86? Okay, two buttons. So use, use stick on this, too. Yeah, you can only have one bomb on screen at a time. So I think games like this definitely definitely started to mark like a uh a focus on like arcade games having a an actual like ending, an actual goal. Although if you do Volgasu, Sun Sun, Higemalu, nineteen forty two, X Texas, Commando, Makamura. Although if you do finish section Z, it does start over in loop two. So yeah, when he dies, he has a Psycho Billy freakout. Uh, bring this up a little bit. Pew, pew, pew. Oh, those are some Capcom-ass sound effects right there. Alright. And hey, you don't die from colliding with, uh, with the ceiling. Always appreciate when a shmup does that. So your bombs have a big hitbox, which is good. What do we got here? B. Okay, the vape clouds can kill you. And there's a speed up. Yum! Always fast. If you shoot the satellite, it keeps going up in value. 
Ah, I got greedy. <laughs> All right, I should have I should have reset, but it's fine. Oh, there's a Metroid in there. Yeah, it helps to it helps to go for points. You get extends at what was it, thirty thousand in every seventy or something. Already beat the default high score. Ugh. So when your shot power goes up, I guess you can have more shots. Whoa! What the fuck? Found a secret. Again, no auto fire. Oop! There's another. Okay. Wasn't ready for it. Never mind. Just focus on survival. I don't want to lose these power-ups. Oh, blah, 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 blah. Okay, I'm... I'm playing really bad. <laughs> I've definitely gotten past the first set of stages without dying. Oh, well. This isn't a... This isn't a super play exhibition. Fine. That's just what I'll keep telling myself. Like, I keep thinking it's a game I really should try to do a loop of. You need to, like, sit down and make save states and stuff. boss. Good. Here's the section E. Bonus points for 58 theory. Let's try the section J. So now it goes vertically. I do kind of like that the game oh, is just one time. constant. Whoa, Ty! Thank you for the big ol' host. Holy cow. Damn. Thank you very much for the host, Ty. Welcome in, everybody. I'm playing playing Section Z, the arcade version, not the NES version. Whoop. Uh, what was I gonna say? <laughs> I like that the game is just one constant, like long stage. Like it doesn't it doesn't cut away for like you know show a show a black screen or whatever. Gives you the feeling you're really in the base. Oop, what is it? Ah! Oh god. I hate this part. This is where a speed up would help if I hadn't lost it. Yeah, the game the game does loop forever, but I I think it might be one of the Capcom games that cuts off extra lives when you get to a million. Because there were uh, there were a few that did that. Commando, I think Ghosts and Goblins did. Power up. Not put a lot of shots on the screen. Oh my god. I didn't rip and move. Ah. See, I mean, this game doesn't seem that hard, but I always just die to the, the most inane shit. I like how the bosses die super fast. I rented the NES version back in the day and had no idea what was going on in it.
And I did try it out in the... around the time that NES emulators were becoming a thing, but I... Uh, I don't think I even finished it with save states. I should probably do that at some point. Uh, power up. Ah! Okay, I don't know how to manipulate that. I got stuck on the floor. <laughs> All right, well, gotta do the thing. Double a cock boat. It's a weird high score music. Well, why does it show a? Uh... Push the start button, dummy. Right. Yeah, Captain was giving giving shoutouts to all the homies. Okay, how do I do that? I guess. I tried to shoot him. Unfortunately, it kind of becomes one of those things where, you know, you, you die and you lose your power-ups, it becomes uh, a little more difficult to survive. Oh yeah, shoot this thing. That's what kills it. I get it now. Except you can't do it here. Oh my god! Got the zoomies! Uh, Dumplechon, thank you for the... for the 76 months! Hey, much appreciated, as always. Uh, this does loop. But it does have a... It does have an end goal. something tight. <laughs> oh, it's a weird hitbox. I got an extra life? I thought it was 30,000 for the, for the extra. Anyway, we're in pinball world. Fuck it, let's put that let's put this in the base. The evil alien base. Let's have a let's have a pinball section. Okay. Power ball. It's not yours. Uh oh. Oh god. They got they got their own jetpack assholes. Here is the section O. Let's try the section T. Spartonberry, think of the 45 months. Much appreciated. Ah! Okay. Going into Geiger Guts world. Uh oh. Uh oh. Gotta get down there quick. I assume you're supposed to be doing this. Oh god, you're being chased. Fucking rat race. 
nice. Oh, what? I'm supposed to react to that? Alright, stay over here then. I'm not fast enough. I, I lost my speed up. <laughs> okay. Uh... There we go. Okay, where do we go now? They do shoot at you, fuck. Seems kinda cheap. Yeah, yeah, each tick in the top left is one of the letters. They do show the letters in the, in the stage when you pass them. All the letters are marked. Uh, okay, this way. So the bomb can't collide with enemies uh, as it goes down. The bomb only explodes on impact. There we go. Mom gave me an extra life. That was sick. Also, more more bugs and bees. Another, another bee power. Give me that. Oh, okay, whatever. Fine. Like one speed up already seems pretty fast. Gotta see what it's like with three. I guess the thing I don't like is that the turnaround button has, like, animation, so you can't, like, instantly start firing in another direction, so there is, like, a little, little tiny bit of a delay. Oh my god! There I go, my power-ups. I hate these green things. Oh my god, what are these hitboxes? Alright, I was trying to shoot the green guys. Alright, I'm not doing this every time. Take that, Volgasu. Alright, we need to... GG's for what? <laughs> I did I didn't beat my previous score and I'm I'm credit feeding. That wasn't GG's. Nothing I'm doing here is GG's. Fuck, this this part kicks my ass. Those green guys have like Really small hitboxes. Okay, what do I do on this part? Oh, the bomb! Right, right, right. Gotta hit them on the wall. Okay. Yeah, I don't think I've ever gotten past the section on one credit. <laughs> Pretty sure. Has always been the wall. He's got to get in here with a lot of power ups, I guess. And then don't die. You really need all the shots you can get. Okay. 
I'm sorry, right? I can't refer to things as difficulty walls. I made it to the second S. <laughs> He's so scared. This guy's been scared out of his balls. And all the creepy Geiger stuff. They really don't give you enough power-up items. There's been like, maybe three the entire game? <laughs> maybe four. And a lot of these enemies have very small hitboxes, so you need to be able to, to fire as many bullets as possible, I think. Oh, it's in the star. It's, no, wait, no, it's Scarface. Hit him anywhere. Okay. I Hofker. I Zunger. Alright, let's try this section Z. Ooh. Very ambient. Oh. <laughs> and then it plays this music. Oh, cool! Oh, they respawn, shit. This is not the music I thought was gonna play for the final stage. Run, run, run. Oh, they can fire, of course they can. Okay, I, I, I thought I could, like, sneak in and start shooting. I don't get it. What are you supposed to do there? GG's. die from running into walls, but you can get screen crushed, of course. One of those. Yum. Oh, you can actually kill those? Let's see. This is not final stage music. I'm sorry, Capcom. <laughs> Try again. Killing all the Metroids. On. Once you get past the beginning, like, that first part doesn't seem as, as bad as, uh, the vertical stage. Then again, there's these enemies. I 
Okay, never mind. Things are getting worse. They died of bombs. There he is. That's it. Whoa! <laughs> He's crouch flying. That was sick. Special bonus 10,000. Let's try the section E again. <laughs> he kept the squat the entire time. That was pretty cool. So the game doesn't waste any time. Throws you right in the loop, too. Uh, I'm not sure if it's really that much harder in loop two. This looks like the PS5. Uh, yeah, okay. <laughs> Finally, the PS5 has a game. Alright, well. Yeah, that, that last stage isn't that bad compared to the... the stage before it, I think. I feel like if I could ever... if I could ever get past that section on one credit, I could probably do it. Maybe. Oh, we get vaped on. Die from running into the base. I don't, know. I, I, I don't think it's a five, but this is a neat game. Uh... Long go booty. That high score music, it's like, uh, it's RPG music when you stay at the end. Very weird soundscape in this game. Wow, that was a, that was a really good demo. <laughs> Just get shot immediately. But yeah, it's it's neat. It does have some some very frustrating moments, but if you get good enough at this game, you can play it for a while. People have done very long credits of this. The true killer app for the PS5 <laughs> or whatever. <laughs> Okay. All right, I have to give it a couple seconds before I hit the button, right? Double KO on a boss and it soft locked the game? That's a problem. Can't say I've seen that happen. There's like two different... There, there's a, another... Uh, ROM revision of this in MAME. I don't know what the differences are. Whoa. Just drop some frames. I guess it doesn't matter. Nothing's happening on screen right now. <laughs> I love how the demo just sometimes eats shit immediately. I should try Space Weed on the NES. Is that like a uh, cokehead junkie? Alright, 79% gave it a 4. No, that, that hiccup was definitely, definitely on me. I saw my, uh, my bitrate, like, spike.
And yeah, this is a pretty neat game for 1985. It's got, uh, like I said, it's interesting that it, uh, it has a, uh, it's designed to give you a goal to, to work towards. I mean, a lot of games were doing that, but, you know, the way this game shows you the, it, all, it always has the map at the top left telling you how far you are. It kind of, kind of entices you to keep pushing. To try to kill the L brain. Yeah, I can, I can go for. It's pretty neat.